All right, we're back with Li Hong's assassination. One of the hardest, longest missions in the game. Pretty ridiculous. <sighs> All right, well, uh, Diana talking your ear off again. Uh, so we need to find safe combination from a hooker. Uh, we need to find the safe location from a prisoner. Deliver the jade figurine to an old guy. And eliminate Li Hong, who's another old guy. And... That's it. There's Lee Hong. He's like about 70 or something. And there's the map. Who cares about that? So all we're taking is fiber wire, a knife, and Kevlar. Because, you know, the Kevlar might help. Unless we get shot in the head, which does happen a lot in this game. So. Yeah. Open. There we go. Yeah, this mission was remade in Hitman Contracts. It's actually the second to last mission or something. I think it is the second to last mission, yeah. So, pretty, uh, pretty cool. Um, kind of weird that it's the second to last mission. Everything's reversed because one of the final missions in this game is like the first mission in that game, and then this is one of the first missions in this game, and it's like the last mission in Contracts. So, kind of neat. Alarm, alarm. Yeah, I don't know why they remade missions. It's kind of, eh, kind of takes away from the enjoyment a little bit. I mean, there are, like I was saying in my one of my uh, one of the other missions before this one, like what was it, two missions ago or one mission ago? I can't remember. Um, that okay. So we got to talk to nice the place. Yes, sir. Is this your first visit to Hong Kong? Yeah, unfortunately. I have to settle an account, so there'll be no sightseeing. Well, if you do have a little spare time, I think you would find a visit to our massage parlor on the second floor worth your while. I'll put your drink on your bill, Mr... Shut up. Ain't tell me my name. None of your damn business. So take the paper, and we are going to go into the dining room, which is right here. We gotta kill a waiter. Now I know waiters are uh, technically civilians, so we do get deducted a bit of money from killing a waiter. But pff, who cares? It makes the mission so much easier. It's just ridiculous. Okay. Where are the waiters? There's that green guy. He's a waiter. You can take his outfit. Oh, let's kill this guy. There he is, right on. Use the glitch again to bring his body in here. And people don't see his legs, so it's all good. I don't think they do anyway. Shit, I should be safe. And... Ah. Just pull him a little bit further up. There we go. Nice. Okay, so we're, we're in the clear, because we got to kill this guy. Oh, we don't have to, but it just makes life easier. So let's just do it. Hey, got to be really quick there. Ah, come on. There we go. Sweet. Okay. Welcome, honorable guest. Every pleasure is available inside. That running while dragging the body glitch is so freaking cool. Like, it helps so much. It's not even really part of the game, but it helps so much. Welcome, honorable guest. Shut up, fat boy. I've already heard what you said. So let's take this guy out. Drag him down just a little bit, just enough. Perfect. Let's talk to the pimp. Welcome to our den of iniquity. It is our business doing pleasure with you. May I introduce my number one girl, Lei Ling? She will do everything you desire and more. Cash or credit card? 
I'm sure. I have a bill at the bar. Just follow Lei to her room, my friend. And do not drool on the floor. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, Lei Ling, huh? Sounds like Mei Ling from Metal Gear Solid. Hmm, I wonder where they got the inspiration for her name. Yeah, I've always thought that somehow Hitman, Siphon Filter, Splinter Cell, and Metal Gear were somehow just intertwined. Somehow, I don't know. They're probably not, but. So, what's new and exciting around here? I don't know. You tell me. I've been here too long. You don't like being here. This is Hong Kong. Like it doesn't come into it. Well, let's begin here then. Who are you? I'm not who you think I am. Just as the mirror is not always just a reflection of what you see. I do not belong here. What about you, mister? I'm here on business, looking for Mr. Lee Han. Actually, I'm looking for his safe. I see. Well, help me out of here, and I might have some information for you. Okay. It's a deal. Follow me. I know a way across the roof and the combination to Lee Hong's safe. I found it in his trousers. Ew. He's like 70 and you're like 25, maybe? 20? I don't know. Prostitutes are really young sometimes. Too young. So, follow this chick. She runs so damn slow, I guess because she's wearing high heels, but I don't know. You women in your high heels, I don't know how you do it. I don't know how you do it. So we're gonna make her scream really uh, over exaggerated there. Shh. Shh. Quiet till the end of the cutscene. Yeah, we don't even need to be quiet there. I'm gonna take his outfit and. We don't need to hide his body. It's all good. You don't even need to kill that guy. I just did. Quick! There's a CIA guy in the basement. He might know something. Here, I can give you the combination to the safe if that is of any help. I found it in a pair of Lee Hong's trousers. Good luck to you, handsome. Just a gratitude handshake. Ew, gross! Ugh, I feel so violated. I don't know where her mouth's been. Uh, yeah, so you could do things the easy way and kill her. That way you wouldn't have to go through that whole sequence of, you know, um, following her and all that crap. But, you know, she's a civilian. And we've already killed one civilian, so no sense in killing another one. Because I think that if you kill two, that's like a thousand bucks off your pay, which is really nothing, but still. Where? Okay, what? Doesn't he patrol? Yeah, there we go. As soon as you stop moving. What the fuck? Drag his body. I'm just gonna bring him in here. I don't even know if that'll do anything, but whatever. Leave immediately. You can piss off. Because you were so rude to me, I'm gonna slit your throat. Watch out! In the alarm. Damn it. Okay. Drag his body. Be kinda quick, because you never know when someone's going around the corner. But we already killed the only guy that patrols, so it should be okay. And here's the prisoner, and you have to listen to the first part of this cutscene, because he tells you where the safe is. Just the man I've been looking for. Jeez, am I glad to see you. I'm halfway dead here. So, how did you end up in this mess? I tried to unlock the safe in the meeting room at the VIP area, but I don't have the combination for it. I think one of the girls on the second floor knows the combination. Let me help you out of here. Alright, so VIP room. Gotcha. So rough on me. Relax, 47. That's what he's thinking. Gross. Totally gross. Uh, so, now we gotta go to the VIP room. 
We already took out the waiter. We got the combination. Yeah. So we just need to go to the VIP room. Grab the jade figurine. And once we've done that, we can uh, proceed on taking out Li Hong. I believe you can go out this way. What the hell? I just walked through the door. Okay, bud. You go and do that. I think the VIP room is on the side of this garden. Pretty sure. So pretty. Like, this entire area was remade exactly the same as in contracts. Only difference is it's uh, dark out. So that's kind of cool. And I will be doing a Let's Play for Hitman Contracts because that game is awesome. And I just want to do the whole Hitman series, including Absolution. Because I really enjoy that one. Even though it doesn't really resemble Hitman as much as it should. It's still an amazing game. And I think that's partly because I'm a Splinter Cell fan. Here's the VIP room, so we need to take out this guy. Uh, we need the knife. Uh, I just dropped it. There we go. Sweet. Take out this guy now. Restricted area. Leave immediately. Nope. I ain't doing that. Okay, you're dead. Sweet. Jade figurine. Alright. Now let's go out the same way we came in. Hopefully no one spots those bodies. Because if they do, I'm screwed. Go out this way. So pretty. This game was revolutionary for its time. Like, it came out in 2000. Uh, and... Like these graphics are pretty significant considering the year it came out and the, the time it was it was way ahead of its time basically so pretty awesome all right now we got to switch clothes turn into the waiter done Yeah, killing that guy in that area back there, it just, just makes things so much easier. Okay. Now he's off to talk to this old guy who honestly speaks way too much, way more than he needs to. And, ugh, you guys are in for a treat. I'll just say that. I'm in for a treat, because I've heard this guy like a million times. And he walks slow, and god damn it. <sighs> Greetings, most venerable visitor. I have been expecting you. I believe you have something for me. Here you are. In return, tell me how I get close to Li Hong. Ah. Just as the fox has several entries to his den, so there is more than one way to gain access to the lair of the liege. You can find him in his headquarters, where he is most secure. Guarded by Tsung, his trusted personal bodyguard. Go to the secret passage in the basement. Hmm, interesting. Any other suggestions? It is man that can make the way great, not the way that can make man great. You can choose another path to Li Hong by means of deception. This small flask with white powder has great potency. A leader is always weakest when his guard is down. The man you are looking for will be eating at the restaurant. Oh god, that was brutal. I don't know if you guys thought it was that bad, but holy smoke. Longest conversation ever for how much he, for how many words he said. God damn. Serve this soup for Mr. Lee Hong, who'll be arriving shortly. He'll be arriving shortly. So let's pop the poison in there, right beside the guy all nonchalant. Like, you know, 
No big deal. He doesn't know what that flask contains. It's all good. Maybe it's just spices. Oh yes, it's spices. And they will spice up your life. <laughs> Here you go, Fatso. Oh, you like it? Is it good? Oh, good. Good. Yeah, that's right. You fall over and knock that chair down. Oh no, what do I do? Oh no, materialized gun from carpet. Ha, <laughs> they didn't think I could do that, did you, soon, huh? No, if I could teabag you, I would right now. Okay, uh, let's go. Get out of here. Nobody suspects that you did anything. So don't worry. And even if they do, we're about to switch outfits, so... Oh, 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 oh. Ah, ah, perfect. Now it doesn't even matter if they see us, because... Who cares? So we need to go into the basement. <laughs> no one suspects a thing. Sweet. Go back down to the basement now. Hey guys, I'm just one of you, except white, and bald, and I don't have a gun. Uh, there we go. Pick that up, just in case, right? I only have 30 bullets on it though, so that kind of sucks. But it should be enough, because I'm going to grab these things. Perfect. That's amazing. I think I go this way, don't I? Yeah. Beautiful. So now, all we got to do now is kill Lee Hong. And it's pretty easy. I don't know. It's. I always thought it was extremely difficult to, to, to just find him. That's the hardest part, is finding him. Killing him is whatever. Okay, so we'll go down and then we gotta go up. Alright, I'm ready. I am ready. I'm pumped. Where's the Megadeth? I need to play some Megadeth. Set the tone. Yeah, Symphony of Destruction. Megadeth is awesome. Damn, I gotta listen to some Megadeth after this. Okay. Now we're going upstairs. We're gonna take this bitch out. Okay. Uh, get the knife ready. Hopefully we don't need the gun, but if we do, we can always pick it back up. But we are gonna drop it in a second. Good. Nobody's suspicious. So there's Lee Hong. We actually have to wait for him in this room. This is the best room ever to kill him. So let's just drop our gun. And wait for his ass. Come on, bitch. Get your ass over her. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. He wants to die. You can see it. Hey, buddy. Remember me? I took out your bodyguard just now. And now I killed you. <laughs> they don't expect anything. Or suspect anything, I should say. Sweet, that's it. A couple of them are a little freaked out, but they're probably just stretching. Looks like you guys are just stretching your backs. Okay, that's good. Yeah, have a little workout. Sweet. Yeah, let's kill this guy. <laughs> yeah. So that is the mission. Enjoy the creepy cutscene. They have spent a lot of money on this professor. We want killing machines, not just machines. Will he be able to feel any pain? He should have a lot of pain. It makes people obey orders. Do not worry, he will be perfect. 